Now he's moving quick. So at this point, good job. And he's doing just what you said. Yeah, you might want to get that hand up there. Okay, perfect. perfect. Now, if I would get closer to the ground, keep him low. Yep. When you lift him, he'll start coiling around your yep. hands. So get on one knee. All right. Now do this thing. Yeah. Inside there. And guys, if a snake coils around you, just uncoil it. People are like, what do I do? Just unwrap it. I'm going to get his head in here first, right? Yeah. So this would be good, like, if you had a team or something, yep. you come in. Yep. You have a friend or something come and help you unwrap it? I can see. They're strong. It's like yeah, a they are. Wow. Double blood pressure cuff or something. Yeah, nice. One more. Uh, there we go. All right, now tap him. Yep. No, so first get, like yeah, this. get as much as you can into the body, into the bag. Cinch it around the body. Okay, you can let go of the head once it's cinched. So just keep... Yep, there it goes. Yep. All, let him do all the work himself, basically. I find if you kind of just like flick them a little, they go, yeah. they go more. Yeah. Flick them gently. Yeah. He doesn't want to go yeah. too high. You got to feed him into. There it goes. <laughs> Beautiful snake. It's almost inside. I say when you get closer to getting the whole tail in, just be careful. It, yeah, because the head could come yeah, out. Yeah, the head could come right out. Yeah, that's what it feels like. Alright, good job. I'll take that. So, what would, you, what would you do after this? You would. I would t tape it. Okay. Then I'd put it in another bag. Double tape it, put it in a box marked Dangerous Reptiles, and call somebody or bring it to you. Perfect. All right.